Hello, welcome to the reading room with Sylvie here. Um, today we're going to do a reading on uh, family, friends, or loved ones. So you pick your person. And it's, uh, why did they ghost you, distance themselves from you? What's going on there? Did you choose your deck? Just take your time, you know, whatever pulls you towards the deck, the stone, the way they're sitting. Okay, group one, let's see what's going on. So the... So, you know, you pick your person, family, friends, or loved ones. It depends who you're wondering who ghosted you, who kept, who distanced themselves from you. So, why did they do that? Like, you know, so obviously someone did, but you want to know why. Yeah, exactly. Why? And that's exactly what the card is saying, why? Like, what's going on? Like, you know, you were communicating, you were talking. You were being supportive. I feel that you were being supportive. And you were talking, but there was something um, um, not sitting right, something instigating between both of you. Um, there was an issue. Um, maybe uh, no one's particular fault. It just seemed to divide you into and on, both, on separate sides, I guess, um, of the issue or the problem. Um, but you were being trying to be supportive and you were, you were trying to be supportive, but at the same time you did instigate it in some ways and you did, uh, kind of snap because it, for whatever reason, whatever was being buggy or whatever was, uh, instigating, I'm not quite sure. So you may have reacted to a, to their way of being. But they were standing firm. For some reason, they stood firm. They they believed in what they were saying, and they were being very passionate about it. And um, they feel like they were they that that's how it was. They were standing their ground. So let's find out. But you're the one that's full of emotions and um, didn't understand a thing. Uh, I also get that they didn't care about that part. <laughs> that's what I get. Okay, so um, they see you as uh, very capable, very um, busy, very able, um, strong. You you can do whatever you put your mind to it. You take decisions sometimes, but you're also a pain in the butt. That's how they see it because you do so much. You do too much sometimes. They see that. They feel that. They feel like you, but you are accomplished and um, and you do well. You just jump into things without thinking or you, you just take on a decision and there you go, off you go. Um, you, you do make your, your, your plans, you do make a list, but how, how you uh, actually, um, for some I feel like you actually literally make a list, like, I'm going to go do this, 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 and then you do it like a, like a, like a, a bucket list or something, you know, <laughs> you, you, you have goals for the week or something and you go ahead and you make your list, but how about, how are you going to go about doing it or how's, what it, how it concerns others or something like that, it doesn't seem to be an issue. Um, they don't see that you um, take time to decide what you're going to do, like what, like on that list of yours or on the, it doesn't literally have to be a list for everyone, but you know, like uh, some of you are just thinking it in your head, I'm going to do this, this 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 week, or this is my goal for the week or, you know, whatever, but you're, you're definitely take time to, to assess uh, what you're in the mood to do or what you feel like doing or, or like you're very, um, you like to explore, you like to do, you like to go, and um, that's who you are. They don't see that exactly. They just see that you just jump, dive in without thinking, you know, but that's not necessarily true at all. Um, yeah, it's true. It, it's your wish. Like, you, you wanted things to go a certain way, and, um, or they did, and, um, they definitely, well, I feel like you both put big effort. Like one was, was, uh, saying, Hey, let's do it. Encouraging the other. Uh, but the other one, one of you, you have to put in content of who's doing what, but one of you is doing, is doing something and the other one is encouraging you to do it. So it depends how it fits with you. Um, but it was definitely something that was, uh, good and, and, 
and uh, worth doing and um, definitely a fun. So you guys were 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 like almost like teamwork. One has the talent, one had the the. Um, I feel like one had the the resources and the other one had the talent, sort of thing. And uh, together, you guys were doing great. You were you were handling things pretty good and. Um, and enjoying what was going on and and still can be this way by the way it doesn't have to not be talking i mean this still can happen it still can keep going i don't see it ending by any means um yeah there was some there wasn't oh there was nothing really wrong there was no difficulties there was no big issues there was uh, nothing it's just hurt feelings so some, it was just the tone or what was said, it was actually not very big. It wasn't like a big issue. It just uh, went in the wrong direction and it kind of like kept going, you know, and it wasn't really a big issue, but um, it got bigger as you talked or as you kept going on this, this, uh, this conversation. Mm. I feel this completely has to do with the conversation. I, it's 100% for me. That's how I feel so strong about it right now. That's the messages I'm getting. So if you didn't have a conversation with them, there was a miscommunication for sure. I mean, something was said somewhere, but um, it had nothing to do with, the, with what was being done and how it was being done. It was It was something that hurt the other's feelings. Mm. <laughs> sorry so here I feel that um, it's like like again one one did um, hurt the other one's feelings about what they were doing it was almost like they knew it exactly how what they were doing they had every um, intentions or every knowing that that would hurt what they were going to say. So in the conversation, yeah, um, the it all had to do with how things were said. And they were said on purpose. Intentions to hurt. Because they got hurt. The feelings got hurt. And then the, the intentions were to hurt back. So, um, yeah, on that. Work on it and reflect on it. That's what I get, that, that, that this has to be worked on and reflected on. Like, like both of you are, are, um, it's like, it's like, um, you both had time to, uh, you had to pull back. I guess that's what it is. You had to pull back and reflect on what you were doing and what you were thinking or what had just happened. And um, time needed to, to, you guys are so, so like a team or, or, you know, it's like, it's like if you're not brothers or sisters, um, you sure act like it, you know. Um, It's like you guys are both balanced in some way, but both different. You both have your own way of doing. Like one's a thinker and one's a doer, you know. And um, your best friends, uh, you're you're meant to. Like you're not done. This is not done. This is not going to be ending here. Um, there's more to do. You both ha have more to go. You're both you're both planning to do, to go, um, continue. So this will be fixed. This is not long lasting. It just has to work it through. You both have to work it through and get together on that, on on what just happened. I feel like um. Yeah, it 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 really feels like that. It feels like that it needs to be talked through. I'm just gonna pull a few more cards. Where's my death?
Oh yeah, fresh start. That's what I was feeling. I was feeling that, but I didn't want to say it um, without pulling cards. Um, yeah, it's it's definitely like you guys are gonna um, work it out. You're going to battle it out. Like it's gonna you're gonna let go of this stress. Like untie um, once tied up. Like you know, like you you kind of like um, gonna free each other up and. Um, and and be supportive. Walk through the, walk through it. Like you know, new beginning, new start, new way of being. So you're gonna talk it out. You're gonna work it out. It just needs time. You need to absorb it, and they need to absorb it. And then, and then when you guys are ready, it's gonna be uh, back to normal again, back to being what it was. That's what I'm picking up. I'll give you. I'll give you. Send you a message for yourself though. Oh, you're going to do good. You're going to get your wish. You see that? Your wish is granted. Oh, you too. <laughs> wow. Well, um, it says right here that uh, you, you're going to find your way back home. Like, you know, like you're going to go through a few things and then and then uh, get back home and, and, and you're going to make it all the way to where you're supposed to be. And you, you have your wish. They're giving you your wish. It'll take it'll take a few tries or both of you to get together, but see, you're gonna find peace. Group number two. Let's see what's going on with you. So what what is it? And don't forget to pick your person, family, friend, loved one. You know, um, it can be your lover, no problem, or your partner, but it's it's definitely you know you pick your person. And um, why did they ghost you? Why did you distance yourself from you? So what's going on? Well, it was definitely a, a definitely the strength was there. So they were they were definitely uh, decided they had enough, or decided that that was enough, and they uh, pushed themselves through. They they um, decided that they were going to make a point. Uh, they were going to go ahead and and do whatever they felt like doing, and they weren't going to give up. Mm -mm. They weren't giving up at all. They see that you're you're relaxing, you that you're taking uh, time out for yourself, and the, or that you you decided that you um, were going to let go of the stress for you. Um, things went too far, and um, you you're you're not going to deal with it. They see that, uh, yeah, you you took a break from it. You decided that this was way too far. You it, this went like beyond what you you were expecting. And, um, like you, you pulled away. That's how they're feeling. You're asking why did they, uh, distance themselves from you and why did they ghost you? But they feel like you're the one who ghosts them. They feel like you're the one who walked way away. Like you, 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 you your eyes are closed. You decided you didn't want to deal with it. You know, you closed your, your eyes, you, you, you turned your ears off, you, you you shut your mouth you you just that's enough and you, you um not handling the stress and you're not even going to care about it you're not judging it you're not thinking about it you you're the one who walked away and that's how they're feeling and um they don't see that you you did you did your best that you did what you could do with them and with the situation and and you you actually managed to do the best you could do with it that they don't see. They, they see that you're the one that ghosts them. Well, it's unknown right now. It's unknown how it's going to go or how it's going to be. Uh, yeah, it's uh, totally uh, like right now it's up in the air how it's going to go. Um, trying to choose a wise decision, trying but don't know how to go about it. Don't know what how to do it so they're they're trying to be wise they're trying to choose the right path choose the right way uh, do the right thing 
but they're not sure and, and that's why they haven't contacted you or talked to you in a while because they just don't know how to go how to open the door for this how to to approach it um but they're definitely definitely um happy to do so and they're going to definitely go ahead they plan on on breaking the ice like making sure they that um this um that you guys talk that they 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 need to clear up it needs to be cleared up um there's some honesty that needs to be said uh what's the problem or why not yeah things went too far the emotions are too high it feels like there was some loss there some loss definitely on 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 uh it needed yeah it didn't see it coming i guess didn't see the hurt coming and so it was like totally unexpected and um the problem is um they have to just dive in and 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 talk to you but uh um they well but uh, they really got their feelings hurt it's all about hurt feelings um in the future like later um farther on in the road um things will be fixed um, definitely fix because they they care about you yeah ah oh, hugging you guys are gonna hug <laughs> oh yeah and things are gonna go back to normal wow um this is just a, a, ta a, a hurt feeling that uh, went wrong you did your best you could do but they didn't see it that way and and then they don't know how to approach you um and they don't realize that you're okay that you're doing you were doing good because you try to do your best um but the feelings did get you did get hurt they got hurt um they were going to uh get a hold of you at, eventually and and because they want they want this to be good and then when when they do like they really love you like they they have a an ideal thoughts of how you are and and they see you in, in a way but they needed time to think about it they needed uh, time to reflect to think and and then you guys are going to hug and make up and then go back to the normal way of being it's not even funny i mean you guys are are like uh, um you guys are both is both supportive of each other oh, uh this person that uh that uh, you're you're asking about is pretty honest and pretty straightforward and pretty uh, uh blunt and and um um they they know what they want they know what they they do so so f you you're more flexible and more able and more um um you can maneuver over things so so that's why it didn't um that's why they they managed to get uh really hurt and stuck on it way more than you and you were like okay so you would have been okay the next day they but them they took longer it, they take quite a bit longer i'm just going to see if there's a little bit more on this is there another message no there's nothing or I'm not going to pull it. I can feel nothing. No vibes on the cards. So let's try this deck. Oh, this deck's popping. See the difference between decks? Look, this one has things to say. Ah, oh, you see. I mean, some decks, if they don't, if they don't speak, you can, you can pretty much feel it. Um. Well, this one here, um, it says you done, you did good. You, I want to say you done good. <laughs> You done good. <laughs> I don't know. For somebody that must mean something. I almost feel the, the laughter of that word of those words. You done good. But um yeah, you, you did really well and uh um you go you're going to be uh very supportive or supported and you're going to do um exactly what you need to do and you're going to shine and um uh, you're you have you're protected and guided and um and not to worry about anything. Things are going to work out to the best abilities. They're going to, they're going to flourish. They're going to be some, uh, some uh, happiness back and kindness. And you are divinely protected. Okay, so that's the message I got. So group number three. Okay, so what's going on? 
who ghosted you? Why did they distance themselves from you? Don't forget, it's your family, friend, or loved one. So pick and make sure you pick them before you you, you uh, do your reading. So, um, yeah, there's a lot of your emotions there. You're holding on to something. You're holding on to some particular emotion. You're not letting it go. You let everything else go, but this one you're holding on to seems to be more important than others. You are definitely, um, yeah, this one seems to be important. It has to do with, I almost feel like somebody got insulted. They insulted their looks or, their, or the way they are, their personality, but mostly I feel like somebody here got insulted by their looks. Like they, they said something that was hurtful towards them in this way. Um, what else am I picking up here? Yeah, but there was some definitely some something that was nasty. Um and yeah, you're holding on to it. Hmm. Well, they see you as argumentative and and you fighting for things all the time and yeah, they they're not um they f they see that you have you 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 think you're right and you're you you have a f you always feel that you're right and that you you're gonna or argue your point no matter what and um they don't see that you you work at being who you are and you're kind and you're and you're always trying to do good and and uh, always trying to be positive and bring out the best in, in yourself and others and stuff like that. You know, they don't see that right now. They, well, they may know it, but right at this minute, they don't see it. They see you uh, just thinking you're right and, uh, and arguing the point to the break and you won't uh, give it up. The righteous are feeling right. Yeah, this is quite, like, this is quite stubborn. Like, this is like, I'm right, no matter what. I I understand what happened. I understand how it goes. And I am right. No matter what you what you say or what you're going to do, I know what it is going to be this way. It's, so this is quite stubborn. This is quite, like, this is how it is in your face. If you don't like it, buzz off. That's what I'm getting. Like, I mean, is that that's how strong it is. It's not something that um, um, can be worked out. It's not something that's going to sway or be better. Um, this is how it is. And it, and it feels like it's on both sides this way. It feels like it's quite determined to be this way. Yeah, they're not, they're, nothing was given. There's no giving, give or take. There's no, nothing, no, uh, no, uh, um, understanding the right way, or the wrong way. There's not much thinking about anything. The two of you have decided, have taken positions, um, opposite. The, uh, the decision was taken. You know, there was a choice and, and the choice was taken. Yeah. And there's still a choice. You can still make a choice, but so far, that's how it was chosen to be this way. Mm. Well, even if you wanted to work it out, you really don't know how to work it out. You wouldn't. You'd be afraid to, to. To you don't know how to work it out, or they don't know how to work it out. Don't know what to do next. Don't know, like whether they take a chance to talk or not talk, or you know, like can they can they fix it? Can it be fixed? Um, it's, it's so much effort, honestly, like it's, it's just, it went so far, it went too far, it went like, it was like, um, it was far, this went far, like, uh, um, you both hold your own and, and held your ground and, and, uh, I feel like it's like so, so deep. Let me let me uh, pick out other cards. Um, also, like for some somebody, I feel like there's there's it's just not between you two. There's like uh, there's or there's more than one incident. Like it just didn't happen overnight. Like it just didn't bang. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Bang. I'm ghosting you. That's it for you. Or bang. I I'm gonna go as far away from you. Or, or 
talk to you anymore or or, or you know like that distant feeling or or withdrawal and saying well you know what um, you stay on your side I'll stay on my side that just didn't happen overnight this is over time and and a lot of different issues and and um and um, things have been like uh, embedded in 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 this way of being and it was almost like the blow up kind of thing you know um they're ghosting you because they didn't they didn't agree with what you were saying they then and or they don't want to do what you want them to do or or the way you were being they didn't accept it or it's the other way around you didn't accept the way they wanted or they want to be and and they decide well you know what if you don't follow my way that's it so it's you know it depends on you put in your in your situation which person did what you know how it went but um is there any i'm going to ask is there any are you guys going to make up and that's what i'm asking because right now it's right now it looks like it's done or it's not going to you guys are not going to talk about it like right now it feels so solid like you know i just want to see in, in later if um this can be worked out oops so can this be worked out let me see well you you'd have to you'd have you'd both have to want it like you it'd have to be talked about like it'd have to like right now it's unknown like whether who wants what like um it would be just a dream to have it worked out really um uh, but uh it would be a dream to have it worked out that's what i feel so it's either you hoping or wishing that it was worked out or it's them hoping or wishing but it's funny because i pick i can't turn i can't separate you both like i can't separate who's who here it's almost like you both are going through the same thing or 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 for some it's 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 reverse like it like maybe there's you know too many scenarios and some are on one side and the other side but um yeah it would be a dream to fix this but how to go about it is really um it's wide open like it's 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 uh you'd have to take a chance and it has to be talked about it would have to be uh talked and and, and worked out so one is have to take the chance to go ahead and do it and how to go about doing it really is um is just a matter of just actually making the decision to to go ahead and try it and then and then go talk it feels like it, it would take uh um a few times it, it's not going to be easy and it's not going to be solved overnight it would take uh some real talking and then come back and talk and come back and talk and um that's how i feel okay so i'm going to uh pull out another card for you like a message for yourself other than this you know like just for your guidance for yourself and your spirit guides oh. well you know what it shows that if you take if you take action like if you like if you uh take action like if you um it would release the stress it would unstress you to to talk it out so uh you have a way about you that you can go in their face and 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 face them and talk about it and um yeah you might not know exactly how to go how to do it or what to say exactly uh, but um yeah, if you just get in their face and, and uh, you'll get somewhere with them and it would release the stress from you. So if you take, they're saying the, the, your spiritual guides are saying or giving you the message that you take the first step and get in their face and then you will, you'll uh, take it from there. Four. Oops. Okay, let's see what's going on. So, um... Don't forget to pick your the your person, family, friend, loved one. Um, so 
why did they ghost you? Why are they distancing themselves from you? Well, you you um, had a wish or you created something that you wanted. Um, things are going your way or you're, you're doing really, really good. Uh, they see that you, you made a choice and you've been acting on it. And you um, definitely uh, feel good about what you did. It, it releases a lot of stress for you. And that you did well, and that you that you uh, you don't see that you love your situation, or you love them, or you love um, um, yourself, or your self reflection. Like I mean, in a positive way. Um, I mean, uh, I meant it in a good way. Like you know, um, that you've been working on yourself, or that you you enjoy who you are. You're very healthy, balanced individual. That's what I'm trying to say. Or you love someone, or you love them. Um, what's going on here? So, um, time has to do with it. Time, time definitely has to do with it. Putting energy and thought into a lot of things. Things going very well for you. Always acting and always having a new start. So it's like it's like uh, whatever you want, you get. I guess you're you're you put the time in and you get and you and you get. You accomplish uh, your goals, and then you start off with a new goal, or it just your journey just um, flows. So you decide to act on something. It 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 um, it's like it releases stress, or it's not all that stressful for you, and um, and then you just move on. They're they're not. Uh, is, They don't think much about it. Like they, they don't. Uh, there hasn't been uh, thinking about the other person. I guess uh, not much thought has been put into uh, wondering what they're feeling or how they are. Um, it's it's um, giving them a chance or a second chance. You just go through your life the way it is. Um, there's has to do with them giving you a second chance, them giving you chances, or you giving. Your them chances. Somebody's giving somebody chances here, on something. I'll continue in a minute. Yeah, the world's at your feet. You have the strength to get what you want, and you seem to not share it much. So they they feel that you don't let them in. Like you do what you want when you want. You you live your life to the fullest. You you accomplish a lot, and you and um. Th- and you do well, and you're always, you, and you start, you start over, you, you create something new, and you just move on, and, and you just don't let them in, like you don't give them a chance. Yeah, then you, you just go on your way, like they don't know where you're going, what you're doing, or they feel left out, they, they're not included. They, that's what it is, they feel left out, not included, they feel like they're not part of your life, like you live your life normally and you do your things in a normal way and and you create and and and, and move and, and do and and life is easy and good and um like you put the effort you, you you work hard it's not like you know and you do your stuff but uh you just don't include them you don't need them hmm. no you don't need them well, that's how they feel. I mean, I'm not saying that you don't need them. I mean, they feel that way. They feel like you're, you're, they don't see that you love them. So now I, I guess that that is for those who love that person you're talking about or have feelings for them. They don't see it. They don't know it. And for those who are, are, are worked hard on themselves and stuff like that, they don't see that either. They just see that life is handed to you really easy. You flow through it and, um, but then you don't share. You don't. You don't think much of anybody else but yourself. You're not giving them a chance. You don't even look at them and, and wonder what they're doing or how they're feeling or what's going on. So, the whole deck's upside down. Yeah, they just watch. They just watch from. They just watch you.
Yeah, there's just too many cards. Well, I'm going to leave it at that. Um, they're just watching you. They're watching you succeed. They feel like they're in the background observing and watching and wanting to be part of it, wanting to do be part of your life, wanting to do more. And since they can't, they just decided that's it. Like they, they, um, they really think that you're not looking at what they're doing. You're not thinking much of what, what they're doing. And, um, yeah, it's not that like it's easy. I mean, you, you put the effort into it. You work, you, you do your things. Like you take your steps and you do your job and you, and you work and you think and you plan and you act and you, and you, you complete things and things are, are good for you, but because you put the hard work into it. It's like they think you have the world at your feet and you're strong enough to do whatever you want and you're not willing to share. You go where you want. They don't even know what, like, again, they don't even know what you're doing. Like, they, they, they feel totally left out. Mm. They admire you, too. They think highly of you. They just want to be part of you. They want And they want to be part of you so badly that they don't even... That for them, not being part of it, it's too much. So that's why they distance themselves from you. I don't feel like they ghost you as much as I feel like they distance themselves from you. Oops. Well, the message I'm getting for you, like, tr you transform your life into something beautiful, and you follow your intuition, and you and you go with it, and you're divinely guided, and and you get your spiritual family with you, helping you out, and and um, you have this knowing how things work, and that's why you're able to to uh, to. Uh, do what you got to do. That's how come you know how to handle your life and how to work it, and and put you you put in a lot and you receive a lot, and and you work hard and um, but you know you have this uh, knowing about you, and 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 you listen and you and you understand, and you transform everything that you touch or all your life. You transform it to something really great and beautiful and. And something that's uh, colorful, and and you just have this knowing about you, and you know, I feel like you're 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 spiritually guided, and and you pick up on your signals, and you you do what you got to do. Let's pull out and see if they're going if you're going to be okay with them, if you can fix it. Like, is there some fixing to do? So I get some silence, <laughs> pick up silence. Like it's, it's, it's silence. It's like, mm, do I want to jump in or not? Like, do I want to handle this or not? And, um, you love to, you're, you're definitely a good person and you have, uh, it's like you, you would love to make them feel better and, and good about themselves. And you can, if you want, you can jump in and, and do it if you want. It's, it's, um, you, you'll know how and you, and you will have no problem doing so. And they'll be receptive to you if you want, if you want to close that gap and open it up again and, and, and have a relationship with this person, you can do it for sure. Um, there's nothing blocking it. It's just that they, they just don't feel like you need them. Okay. Group number five. Let's see what's going on with you. Well, somebody's holding everything back. Holding back. 
Yeah, they see that you have everything you need and you do what you got to do and and uh, you're well capable and you make your own decisions. You don't need anyone else and you but they don't see that you really th you you look at how it affects others or how it affects the situation on wh how, what you're going to do, how it's going to affect others. And you really do think about that. Mm. Or you wonder how it's going to affect you later. There's something you you put yourself in the other the other position or the other shoe or the you know the other person's uh, a point of view or the other or, or what you're doing. Um, you you think farther than just your, what you're going to do now, but you really like look at it and 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 try to see all the angles or the point of view of others. So you, you just don't take your decision lightly. But they, they don't see that. They just see that you make a decision and that's the way you are. You're just uh, capable and able and, uh, yeah, you just go ahead and think and then choose. You go through life uh, releasing your stress. Anything that stresses you, you just get rid of it. You know how to fix it, work it, and start over. So you don't hold on to anything. So if something stresses you, uh, you just disregard it. Get rid of it. Like It doesn't need to be in your life. You, uh, you uh, listen to your intuition, and you don't uh, care. <clears throat> Not that you don't care about other people. I mean, you just don't care you, about keeping things that are negative around you, and you just disregard the negativities. You know, so however that is in whatever form, it doesn't matter. If it's negative, you just get rid of it because you don't want this type of stress. Or you work at least to try to make your life stress-free. And, you know, so if something goes wrong, you you cut it off or you end it. And then you uh, choose to do it better or choose to do it differently or, you know, because that, there you go. That's why you think of things differently because if something don't work out, you rethink it. They they think that you you uh, for them what you how how things are done how things are put together and um, thought of it doesn't um, doesn't work for them that doesn't work for them like um, it's like things are you you put things together. And you you uh, have a way of feeling, like the way of thinking, or or you you just move ahead and you don't hold on to past uh, issues. You just whatever. For them, it it doesn't work that way. It's 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 uh, they love you and they want to be part of your life. They don't want to be disregarded. So um, they love you. That's that's the problem. And you hold back from them. And, and when you, if something doesn't go, you just brush it off. They feel hurt. They want to work it out. They have baggage. They have faith. They have faith. Uh, or you have faith that you, uh, things will, will, will be good. Like, I mean, you just don't, you, you know, like you're just learning. You just, this is just new to you how to be with someone else. So either you never had a lot of relationships or you never committed to any particular relationship. And for you, uh, things were new and, and uh, you were uh, definitely uh, working on it and you know what you want and you had no problem and they know, they know what they want too or they're new at the relationship. This is a new relationship. There's something about being uh, uh, new and... and, and um, having the understanding of how it works there's there's somebody who has a baggage though somebody that got hurt before and had faith in you or you had faith in them um this is hurt feelings this is uh someone that uh, wants to be uh part of your life and um i'm going to pull more cards because it's not 100 percent clear but they do love you and they uh want to be part of it and but they also don't want that um, they don't want things to be let go past issues are important to them 
They need to be discussed. Oh. Yeah, they 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 know they know what to do. They don't know what to do. They they know what they they want to do, but they don't know how to go about doing it. They are full of emotions. So this is this is a this is a, a hurt feeling again. Um, it seems like they distance themselves from you because they want more from you. Um, they want you to to understand how they feel. They want you to take notice of what they do. They want you to to understand that they're there, um, and they want to be part of it. They don't want you shutting them out. They want to be part of your life. They want to be part of the decision making. They want to be part of of the of what's going on. They want to work things out. And if that's not possible, they don't know what to do with you, so they they distance themselves from you. They don't know what to do with their feelings. So for them. Okay, so you you know like this is not going to be a, a partnership where two is included. Then they're distancing themselves, and that's why. Can you fix it, or can you have them back, or can you what can you do to solve this? Yeah, they say just take. <laughs> Yeah, they t if you want it, you can go get them. You know, you know exactly what to do, and you're more than able to do it, and you'll be successful. So if you want this relationship, just go get them, because they love you. They they want to be part of you, but you have to embrace them and let them in. So if you want it, go ahead. But it's up to you. Oh, I'm gonna pull out my. Um, I'm gonna give you a message. Oh, too many cards. Okay. You can create whatever you want. Oh, you can create whatever you want. Yeah, if you want them, you, the, you're spiritually guided, spiritually protected. You're, you're able to, if you, what your intuition is telling you, then go for it. If you want to create whatever relationship you can go ahead and do it but follow your intuition you can create you can create this relationship how you want there's hope there there's definitely lots of hope there 